Welcome Pisces to your love reading, your bonus love reading for September. I hope everybody is doing well. We are going to jump into your love reading and see what is happening, what is going on, the challenges, what you don't see coming, um, the outcome, what this person is thinking, and what their next move is. So... Of course, I am going to bring other cards in here. We are going to see what this person has to say, but let's go ahead and get started and see what's coming through for Pisces. Sun, moon, and rising signs. We have the four of rings. Upright. Okay. Three of wands. I feel like you're holding on here to the things that you value. All right. This also could be holding back, but I do see you developing uh, new opportunities here in your life and moving forward, following the divine, only looking towards, um, I feel like you're looking more towards the future here. The Queen of Pentacles energy, this is all about grounding yourself. Now, this energy doesn't really need anyone anyways. They're really abundant within themselves. This is a nurturer. This is a lot of unconditional love, loyalty, and someone who's very reliable. So I do feel like you're, do, you are carrying the Queen of Rings energy here, the Queen of Pentacles. Okay, yeah, as you're listening to your intuition, you have this inner knowing about your life, your situation. Your intuition is very heightened at this time. You might be cutting off people that don't want, no longer serve you or any more people that are trying to manipulate, lie to you, anything that's toss, toxic. I feel like you're only wanting truth and honesty in your life right now because you are building your empire here. Okay. All right. Very nice. I feel like you gave a lot already. Your time invested it in a lot of, you know, situations. I see this ring here. So a lot of you guys could be married or in separation here. Uh, or maybe been through a marriage before or, or you know i just feel like you invested a lot of time you have grown a lot within your life two of wands there could be some worry here with the two of wands yes or fear of making the wrong choice um so there could be a feeling of being stuck yeah. and it looks like this person wants to message you there's some type of offer coming in but the challenge is is working as a team being a team player working on the stability so there is some type of lack here. That's the challenge within this connection. There's a lot of lack. Yeah, and then it comes to a separation again or disconnecting from an energy. It's like they're wanting to offer you something, but their actions are showing different from what they say. And there's like, I feel there's like a bit of hope or something that this person may follow through. But with this Four of Swords energy, it's saying that there's a time to heal. Like, you guys could be healers, all right, with this Four of Swords energy. I feel like maybe you tried and tried and tried. You, you know, you approached this in all different angles. And now it's just, like, stuck. Like, what other choice do I have? Yeah, Nine of Pentacles, this energy, I mean, it could be a codependent type of energy, too. Someone who you know, needs validation or always needs someone, you know, they don't, they don't go like really within to go towards wisdom. They more go, more go towards outer for outer influence. I don't know. I, <laughs> I'm just feeling that energy. Yeah. So this person could be appearing more successful than they are, are saying things to you that they can't level up to. Yeah. Five of Cups, there's a lot of disappointment with this energy. I feel like this person wants to recover the situation and there are, is change from what you don't see coming, but this person is still resisting change on their part. Mm, you're gonna get pushed to make a choice, I feel, Pisces. The universe is intervening. So this stuck energy or making a choice or feeling overwhelmed, not knowing what to do or feeling unfocused or in your head, feeling anxiety, the universe is pushing you to do something because in the outcome, somebody's resisting change. Someone's willing to do their part, put in the same effort you are doing to come to some type of compromise to grow a stronger foundation. I don't feel like you're inspired. I feel like you know, it's like you're wanting things to go a certain way for you and your family or for your loved one or within this connection, 
but deep down it's like you're you're the universe like something is resisting from that happening so it's like now there's like some blocked energy and i feel like you are having a lot of faith in yourself or you do have a lot of faith but the will is here now which is your angels the universe are trying to guide you out of something that is stuck and stagnant due to someone else is um resistance this could be causing a lot of anxiety for some of you guys maybe sleepless nights here with the nine of swords Let's see what this offer is with the Page of Pentacles for Pisces. What is this offer? All right. Somebody is wanting to bring something to balance, but there's too much chaos, too much control. Okay, this somebody needs inner healing and they're being very reckless. So even though they want to offer balance, they're actually not following through. It's creating more chaos. I'm feeling like this person yeah is is wanting to like it could be like a temporary thing that this person shows you and then it goes back into chaos um why is this two of swords so something needs to come to balance conflict see disagreements chaos so many obstacles there's clash here a big clash and that's what the temperance says an imbalance chaos disrupted energies um we have king of swords gemini libra aquarius coming into the reading oops let's get more into the challenge with the eight of pentacles energy please this could be a marriage a commitment this could be a strong spiritual beliefs here too spirit spirit i feel is saying that there's a commitment but it feels non-committal it's it i feel like you have a lot of knowledge here with the hair faint you know but there could be some outdated thinking or a need to reconnect with spirit when it comes to this because the universe is in control of the situation no matter how much faith you have no matter how much you try the universe is saying that they are in control i'm because someone here is acting like a tower moment and if you're seeing that that's the universe showing you that this person's resisting they have to work on themselves okay because you're going to be stuck if they're not working on themselves and you're going to start seeing the same patterns over and over again yeah there's like a feeling of like exhaustion so many delays when coming together you know it's like two steps forward ten to steps back type of energy a lot of obstacles feeling frustrated very unexpected delays i feel like you're wanting to move forward i feel there's a lot of action and success coming on your part but when it comes to this person they are not on the same like wavelength or, you know like they're not I don't know if they don't view the way the way that you view things yeah emotionally disconnecting i feel like they feel you moving on or feeling very unfulfilled by them yeah they fire sign aresio sagittarius it's like <clears throat> they know that you're nurturing and loving we also have uh, i think i said it already aries leo sagittarius there is there there could be another energy here for some but i do feel like there is some type of attached det uh, detachment that's here but it's hard to detach okay like there is physical detachment but it's hard to detach from you the will of fortune confusion stress miscommunity it's yeah it the universe is offering you something here definitely something that is going to bring a lot of stability and abundance this is about new manifestations coming into your life whatever you don't like this is a time to really trust the unknown because there is a lot of confusion and miscommunication here and there is blocks someone is making poor judgment and there isn't a, a, a dishonesty okay and lots of arguments but i feel <coughs> the universe is handing you an opportunity 
This person could be kind of, it's just things are feeling cloudy, like really not knowing what direction to take. There is a reckless energy here though, guys. That's what I'm seeing. They're very impatient. They're hot tempered. They're arrogant. They're a bit reckless. They have no self-control at times. You know, they let the emotions get the best of them. Well, and here we are. So it's like, even though you don't have clarity or the answers, the universe is still op offering you opportunities and it's taking you to somewhere. Okay, the universe is only protecting you here. And we do have the hermit. So this is basically saying that there's some disharmony, misalignment, feeling like you're working alone within a situation. I'm um, feeling like it's very one-sided and again conflict because this person is lacking teamwork We also have the hermit which is all about going inwards for spirituality The hermit is very big because this is asking you to withdraw and go towards your inner guidance So a lot of you guys could be like soul searching, right? Um, and I feel like that's where the answers are for you as, as you connect more with spirit here yeah, you do have this inner, oh my gosh, look at this, beautiful, and there's that will of fortune, you have the ten of cups, you have so much happiness here, there's harmony, alignment with family, I feel like that's what you're going in, you have this inner knowing, the inner strength when it has to do with your family or your finances or your happily, your happiness, and the sun here and i feel like that's where the will of fortune is guiding you is like not losing hope because the sun is bringing in pure positivity ultimate happiness okay success positive outcomes for you um and i do see that you know with this energy though that you're dealing with it can't block what's meant for you pisces it can't okay but the universe wants you to trust and let go of control we have this was just a fling for a lot for okay not a lot i'm getting for some someone could have did something behind your back maybe with another energy there's something about one-sidedness too so someone not taking accountability of something i don't know there are some secrets though but i really don't see that much in here but there could be some of you guys who this person maybe caught maybe talking to someone else huh or maybe it was just a friend or however they said I feel like I ruined everything you make me want to be a better person <clears throat> I gave into temptation Pisces you are the love of my life huh I'm getting the grass is greener where you water it right so I don't know what this person did I don't know if this is something that you are like for some of you are going through with the third energy maybe there's a legal paperwork here court paperwork file the separation um we got legal going on <clears throat> sad broken feeling alone due to a committed long-term relationship for some uh this could have been a love affair wow very clear very clear message that this could have been a big love affair that somebody was why things were not coming together because of dishonesty for others of you i feel like this other person is just lacking teamwork really doesn't know how to be a team player holding a lot of resentment in and acting very reckless with their life and emotions <clears throat> so very interesting like twist right there very big twist huh very very big twist all right we got balance Love is not always about agreeing just for the sake of it. A great relationship is one that both supports and challenges. So there is a lot of challenges, it feels. A lot of arguments. You instinctively know what is right for you and you have the power to say no or to walk away at any time. All right, Pisces. Remember to take what resonates with these readings. It's not gonna, it's a general read, so it's not gonna resonate with every single one of you. Uh, but if it did help or resonated, please like, comment and subscribe and I will see you guys very very soon. God bless.